this. What's going on guys? So let's do a little update quickly is uh, I didn't post a video the past few days because I had a few days where I wasn't like swamped with schoolwork and I didn't have to work any overtime for work. So it was kind of just like relaxing a few days. So that's why I haven't posted the video. But I'm definitely going to be back on track posting videos. And let's talk about something that probably everybody's going to be quite surprised about. And I've kind of mentioned it before. And you can tell from the title is about me going competitive. Now hold on. Before everybody freaks out, I'm not going to be going hardcore competitive, which you might be like, well, what's the even point of going competitive? I'm going to go to events, or try to at least, in my area, but I'm not, like, I'm not, while I'm going to take the game more seriously, I'm not trying to be number one, which some people would be like, why would you even try to be better? I mean, hey, if I did good, it's fine, but I'm not, like, going to be investing tons of money into this, but I will try to go to more events and actually playing a competitive deck. Though, I still want to kind of go to events and try to play a non-competitive deck just for shits and gigs. But I also don't want to be like fucking one would like right off the bat and just get tossed. But, that being said, uh, I've mentioned before that I've wanted to play competitively. And I haven't because I was going to this last banless change, format change, and I didn't because nothing significantly changed. Some would argue it did and didn't, but I, could, I personally didn't find anything too earth-shattering of a change. So... I'm not going to invest in any deck. There's nothing really competitively that I want to play right now. I mean, there are and there isn't. Like, uh, I would play some of the decks, but it's just like, I don't, they're not really, like, taking on to me. It's not like, oh my god, I will so spend $300 on this right now. Like, so, it's not like I'm going to be competitive now. For what I'm going for is I'm going to train, practice. And I've been already watching people's videos that are more competitive players to get a more grasp of the game again. Because if you don't already know, I was very competitive um, and back in 2012 and 2013 when I first got back into the game. And then I slowly declined and kind of lost my edge of knowing what's going on and stuff. I was playing pretty hardcore before. So now I kind of want to get back into that when the new format comes. So like I said, with training... Is I've been watching people's videos, trying to test more meta decks, not always the crappy decks, um, and trying to make sure I don't misplay anymore, or try to get a grasp of decks and my opponent's decks a whole lot better so I know what cards they're going to play and when they are playing them, which some people will be like, well, shouldn't you already do that anyways? Yes, but I usually would just play Yu-Gi-Oh! casually, and I didn't pay that much attention. I would just play this new deck that came out and have some fun with it, but now I'm going to actually try to pay more attention to what's going on and I've been doing so by watching YouTubers videos of all sorts of different decks and play styles and things like that. So, what does this mean for the channel? Well, nothing. I doesn't really mean anything exactly, but it goes to show that the reason why I'm going competitive is because I've actually grew bored of the non-competitive, which is kind of a change because I got bored of the competitive and for the longest time, I've been in the non-competitive area and got completely more out of the game because I just enjoyed playing the crappy, weird decks. But now I feel like, and I don't know if it's the aspect of how the game is or what, but I can't play the bad decks because the meta decks just completely destroy the bad decks. So, it, that sounds dumb because the point of playing a bad deck is to have fun and playing against a good deck. But I just find it that I can't even do that well. Not all the time, but even if you're like tier 3 or lower, you just can't even compete. Which has always been the case, but like you don't, it's even hard to have a duel out of like 10 that you win because it's just like these new decks are so much more powerful. So I've been playing more of the competitive scene to try to get an idea of the feel right now, but when it actually comes to competitive play and a deck I will purchase, it will not be until the next format change because new decks will be coming out. And when the format changes, hopefully, I feel like they should try to do a more, I mean, not, it's not me saying they should try, I hope they do a more significant change to the ban list altogether. Um, to actually change how the game has been playing and be a little bit more different. So I will then purchase my deck from there. So I will, the videos will still continue the same on this channel, but I would like to just do an update that if you see more competitive content, do not be scared because I will post the same stuff I post anyways. But I just want to get a little bit more into the game by being a little bit more non-playing raccoons all the time in battle and box <laughs> those decks were fun but it's not it's not what you can do it's not a long-term thing and i'd like to play some newer decks that are coming out when they come out and like i said i would very curious if the ban list will change because 
With this last panelist not being a very significant change, I feel like the next one might be a very significant change. And by significant, I mean just some cards coming back, some cards being taken, and maybe a whole new thing like uh, back when Monster Reborn was taken away and Heavy Storm then was taken away, it kind of changed how our staples are. I feel like a staple swap might be in our future, which would make it interesting to play the new competitive scene. So, don't be worried about it. Let me know what you guys think down below. I, I don't know what I would let you know about, like, there's, I guess, your thoughts on me going competitive, and yeah. So, see you later, guys. Peace. Damn. Uh. Yeah.